morning happy monday meditation monday just uh, i've waited for the light to get just about doable and um hope you've all had a lovely weekend there's a few things that are kind of moving out of retrograde now off the top of my head i can't remember what they are but i think you'll all be pleased to know that what, what date is it today yeah mercury apparently is going out of retrograde today so again as with the kind of the other planets that are kind of one uh, that they've been releasing slowly but surely we're going to feel a little less pressure but of course we've got a, a rather wonderful full moon coming up this week and then the sun moves into scorpio <laughs> so this morning i'm just going to do a simple invocation which will assist you to show up in your brightest light suit wherever you go okay so at the moment we're being required to, sh to to you know like everything that we do we've got to show up and we've got to, we, we it means kind of presenting ourselves in the highest form possible not what we think that we can get away with not what will get the job halfway done but the the, the full us the actual manifestation of our mighty i am presences our highest selves okay so this is this is what our soul is beginning to request from us so i have a very simple and most of you will already know this affirmation wait and i start saying this the minute my feet hit the carpet in the morning and it goes i am the monad i am the light divine I am love, I am will, I am fixed design. And just give yourself a few moments while your monadic presence begins to connect to you so that you become your mighty I am presence. And while this is occurring, just give yourselves a few moments to relax, tune into the energies of the universe, take a few deep breaths into your heart centre. And feel that golden version of yourself downloading. And as your heart is opening, feel your earth star or ask your earth star to ground this energy in. Ground it into Gaia, ground it into the planet, ground it into hollow earth. Feel beautiful silver roots coming out the soles of your feet out of your earth star chakra and just anchoring you in okay and now you are lit up and ready to go so i always say this invocation at least three times so say it either out loud or in your head with me i am the monad i am the light divine i am love i am will I am fixed design. Feel that energy centering you, feel it balancing you. Feel the presence of your higher self, your highest self, which is you actually being embodied. and say it again i am the monad i am the light divine i am love i am will i am fixed design and then with your hand on your heart say these words out loud with authority to the universe i am my highest self i am my highest self. I am my highest self. Because you are. You are your highest self. This is the lifetime that you are embodying that master presence. You're not here for a halfway experience. You're here to do the whole thing. Okay? And again, I am my highest self. I am my highest self 
I am my highest self. And there are various versions or expanded versions of the I, the, the I am invocation that Joshua David Stone brought through in, in his book, it's Cosmic Ascension, it's one that's further down the line. I think it was uh, the fourth in the Ascension series, focusing specifically on or targeting the, the light body and the physical, mental, emotion and the spiritual for bringing it through well ahead of its time. And if you want to take the, if you want to take the invocation, the affirmation one step further, here it is, okay? I am the cosmic monad. I am the light divine. I am love, I am will, I am fixed design. I am the cosmic monad. I am the light divine. I am love, I am will, I am fixed design. I am the cosmic monad. I am the light divine. I am love, I am will, I am fixed design. And really start to feel the higher presences of the cosmos starting to connect into you. And just to top this off this morning, just to really get yourself out the gate on a flying start, if you want, call upon Archangel Metatron for a light quotient increase. Okay, so your light will be kind of fluctuating around the 90% to 95% mark at the moment, depending on what pressures you've got around you, what's going on in your life, whether you could be, it's a quite, quite often, it's, it's a bit of a paradox. We will go through an upgrade program and when that happens, your light level drops, okay? And that happens in order for you to dispel all of the lower frequency energies that you need to, quite often manifesting as physical illness. And then when it rises again, it goes up much higher than it was previously. So a good way to keep this, keep on top of this and really keep the ball rolling is call upon Archangel Metatron for a light quotient increase. I like to really push my push the boat with these. So I, I, I go way over kind of 90 to 95 percent, but because I've worked upon this a long time. So just with your eyes closed, just take a few moments to tune in and ask your higher self, your highest version of you, what is your current light percentage? So just do that quietly with your hand on your heart and ask, and it will most likely be a number between 89% or 90% and 95. Don't worry if it's lower, because it means you're processing. All humans on Earth at this time are above the 89%. It's where we are at the moment. And just ask Archangel Metatron to top it up to a level that is comfortable for you, physically, mentally, emotionally and spiritually. And just feel that light coming in. It will be a beautiful golden orange colour. And uh, just allow that to filter down through your chakras, through your physical, mental, emotional and your spiritual bodies. And when you're feeling shiny and bright, you're ready to go. And uh, it's a good way to, like I say, it's a good way to get out of the gate on a Monday morning. First thing I do when my feet touch the carpet, and I've been doing this for most of the summer now, is the I am invocation. I am the monad. I am the light divine. I am love. I am will. I am fixed design. Talk to you all soon. Lots of love. I'll be back on Friday.